guys, it's Pamp Sam back with another video, and today I'm going to be saying who, in my opinion, is the best safety in the NFL. And before we get into this video, I just want to let you guys know that you guys can follow my Instagram. I'll put it uh, down on the screen right here what it is and in the description down below. And if you guys haven't checked it out, you can go follow me over there because I'll sometimes I'll put some posts up there. Like if there's breaking news, I'll probably post something up there. And sometimes I let you guys know when videos come out early. Not always, but just it's more content of me. So if you want more content, just go check that out. And let's get right into the video. So fourth best safety in the NFL, we have Earl Thomas of the Baltimore Ravens. So if it was a few years ago when he was better, like with the Seahawks, because in my opinion, he was a little bit better with the Seahawks, I think he would be a little bit higher on this list. But the point he is in his career now, I'm going to say he's fourth because he's still a really good safety I just think he's getting a little bit older, or since he's getting a little bit older, I think he's getting a little bit worse, but he's still very good, definitely in top five in my opinion. You guys can let me know down below who you think the best safety is, but that we all have our own opinions, so you let me know your opinion down below. So third best safety in the NFL, I have Derwin James of the Los Angeles Chargers. So Derwin James, in a few years, he might be higher up on this list because he's still fairly young at this point. So he still has time to improve, and I think he will improve these next few seasons. And I think he'll get up to top two, but we'll have to see how he improves. But I think Derwin James is a really good safety. Can help that, will help that charter secondary on defense. And they also added um, Chris Harris this season to be the other corner, so that's good. That'll just make Derwin James' job easier because Chris Harris should be able to lock down whoever he's guarding at least most of the time. And then second best safety in the NFL, we have Mika Fitzpatrick of the Pittsburgh Steelers. A lot of you guys might think, why is Derwin not here or Earl not here or some other safety? The reason I have Mika Fitzpatrick here is after he got traded from the Dolphins and Steelers last year, he played really well. Like it was crazy how well he played. You gotta look back at his stats and stuff, but he played very well for the Steelers. And if he can continue that, I think he could keep this spot, maybe even move up to one if he continues playing like he did last year. We'll have to see if it was a fluke or if it was that's how he's going to play in Pittsburgh. We'll have to see how it turns out this next season, the next few seasons as it comes. And the best safety in the NFL, in my opinion, is Jamal Adams of the New York Jets. So I think he's a, the best safety in the NFL, and he's just going to get better because Jamal is very young, so he'll be able to just – because he was only drafted in 2017 with the, with the sixth pick. So he's still, a, he's still young. So he'll definitely be able to develop. So the only thing with Jamal Adams, if the Jets are going to trade him, if he wants to get traded, they have to try to get a, I would say they should try to get a lot of value for him. Because in my opinion, he's the best safety in the NFL. So you got to ask for a lot of value. So if they trade him, hopefully they can get some good value for him in return. Because teams know he wants to be traded, so he's not going to get the full value that he normally would get. But at least the Jets could still get some value, hopefully. Maybe they can get some picks for the future or some young players that could be starters and develop. I, I don't know. They just have to work out a package with one of these teams. Or they keep Jamal and he's just not happy. Which I feel like that's what they're going to do, the Jets. But we'll have to see. But please like the video and subscribe to the channel down below if you haven't already. And if you guys have it, go check out the gaming channel. I'll put a link right here. And thank you guys for watching this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.